Oh man. Let's see. Uh, All right, so we're swapping it up. Yeah, I'm switching so. it up. We still got we still got about two hours, right? Before you're before we're usually done, and before you have to go. Um, yeah. So I think I'm gonna bring out bring out Omnath. I'm gonna switch to. I think is a little bit more powerful than Gabby. <laughs> Didn't you just uh, wait? We're, like, we're going a little. <laughs> I'm I'm playing a Kineo Centiro hidden commander deck. Ooh. I am playing Pokemon. Oh, fun. <laughs> 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 I didn't know we could just do that instead. You know, just like, rule zero. Talk to your yeah, rule zero. Yeah, Ask talk, my group. talk to your playgroup. Oh, if you would just talk to your playgroup, you could play Yu-Gi-Oh while he plays Pokemon, and then <laughs> everyone else is on Magic. Like seriously, it doesn't have to be this hard. Yeah, I like. You know, I'm glad the group agreed to it. Well, I, I, guess, I don't know, Andy. I don't know if I want to bring out other Omnath. I can I play other. whatever at this point because my commander is going to be uh, Sakashima with no partner. By the way, the sick oh. flex. Ooh. Wow. The big dab. The big dab. So you know what? I am playing Omnath. <laughs> yeah. One, one, day, one day. One day, Andy, we'll get the Omnath pod. pod. Well, oh. uh, I was going to talk about it, but mm, this upcoming Wednesday, it's uh, Quad Nines, aka Omnath Lady, and uh, uh, yeah. Andy's upkeep from the uh, from the Scrap Trawlers. I had to think about it for a second because uh, I haven't looked at the schedule for a minute, but it, is, it should be those two. Uh, that'll be Wednesday. Yeah, which I'm excited about. That'll be yet, an, yet another Andy. Yeah, we've had so many Andys. Um, I think he's the second Andy we've actually had on that isn't, you know, he's a cat. you post. Yeah, yeah that, that isn't the host of the same <laughs> uh, Andy okay. Epos, Epos is uh, one of the co-hosts of the CNC Power Hour. Uh, he helped build the web portal and the overlay and stuff. Uh, By the way, it, props on that in public. We talked a little bit in DMs, but this is amazing. This is the best experience I've ever had watching streams. Uh, I was watching this last night on my quest, just sitting back on the couch with the giant uh, Twitch player open. And really, like I've just never been able to watch a stream this easily. Yeah, this is thank, a smooth overlay. I love thank this you thing, so much. Uh, Whatever that, that, long hours you put into it, it's paying dividends now. It looks amazing. Thanks. Yeah, this was all. Um, so yeah, it was it was a bit of a journey from the uh, we cram cram experienced the the old uh, system, which was like kind of a janky like a, a third party stream deck program that I yeah, made the, the publicly Ninja available. One. The uh, well, OBS Ninja is actually what we're using for the camera stuff still. No, the oh. up deck is what was oh, what we oh. were using. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, to touch. To fix our lives and stuff like yeah that. <laughs> to, to fix your like, lives and it didn't quite do to it fix our lives. <laughs> um and that wasn't working and so this end of december i think i sat down and i put up like a proof of concept and i gave it to andy and then andy took it and just made it made it gorgeous made it user u very user friendly and uh has spent a lot of time making it uh making it very useful so i just give him ideas and maybe mock them it. up and uh he uh he puts it all together he's one of the 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 best uh production partner you could ask for i love that type of uh workflow where like you write the user manual or make an after effects video of how it should work and then you say here please make this real <laughs> here's a thing made out of popsicle sticks that i made <laughs> that's that's exactly what happened too because like art. the um the, the scryfall search and the dice thing we we only put those in the past three days like i had the idea like thursday thursday night friday night and i like cut and paste a bunch of stuff in essentially ms paint and sent it over to him and then an hour later we had a working prototype it was just amazing uh, my contribution is that i stress test it they're like hey <laughs> thing we made and i'm just like it doesn't work they're like what do you mean i i just hit buttons and it doesn't work and then and now i'm stressed yeah and now <laughs> And yep. then they fix it. But uh, yeah, thank, uh, th thank you guys. I, I appreciate that. We're trying to trying to make it uh, a bit more accessible to other content creators because uh, it it has a lot more control than spell table. But the actual backend setup, you guys that you didn't see, takes me like an hour before the stream. So um, oh wow, it's uh, and, and that's just that's just because of the way that we have it set up. If you're only doing camera, like play mats, then it's a lot easier. But uh, we can we can talk about that off air or during the game, I guess, because I know Krim has a hard deadline of uh, what oh. No, 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 no. We, we have so much time. There's okay, no right. way. It like, sounds yeah. like he just drew a banger of a hand. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no. So <laughs> the issue here is I like this. This is so funny. Like you're like, oh, this banger of a hand. I'm like, I have a lot of lands, and I like lands. I can play spells <laughs> if I have lands. I've, I've got five lands and an Omnath deck, so I'm 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 gonna keep. But... I've mulliganed three times, and so I'm at this point. I'm just saying I'll keep a two lander and figure it out. <laughs> I'm I. Ah. I, I got three lands and repeated 
a repetitive card draw, so I'm feeling pretty good. All right. Wait, you know what? Do it then. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um. So I guess Jake technically lost. So Jake, do you sure. want to go first? Uh, or do oh, you, you bet I do. Do we? Okay. All right. Cool. So we we sort of like free format. Either whoever lost first goes, um, or whoever didn't win, or whoever won goes last. And in this case, both of those are you. So like, or require you starting. Jeez, so. thanks. You're <laughs> dang it. All right. Essentially, you got dunked. <laughs> and so. <laughs> <laughs> You better play a bloodstained mire and fetch for something and pass the turn. Alrighty, I'm gonna draw lands. Please. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna play a Terramorphic Expanse, crack it, sack it for a planes, and pass. Uh, yeah, I'll keep. Yeah, whatever. I'll just keep. <laughs> oh, I was about to say. I, I, I thought. I thought you'd keep. You'd kept already. Do you need a mulligan? No, no, no. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. I, I, I'm gonna just keep mostly lands. I'm gonna play Myriad Landscape. Okay. Alrighty. If it makes you feel any better. I'm also keeping mostly lands. Uh. I mean, yeah. That's that's usually how it goes for me, Commander. A ton of lands. Sure. We'll see what I draw. <laughs> I'm gonna play this forest, and, and you know, since I since I drew the land or I'll, I'll play the land or then I'll pass. All right, I got a Sacred Foundry tapped, so untap, draw. Uh, oof. Oh, baby, going to play that Temple Garden, being two life, and then I'm going to cast Farseek. Not the Hallowed Fountain, <laughs> Farseek. <laughs> All right. How much yeah. realist? Uh, I got, I got, we're going through some stuff over here. Look at this. Oh, turn. Have you yeah. noticed the games oh, without bad. green? I'll draw. Everybody <laughs> just like, you know, plays some magic, passes. <laughs> yeah, plays plays one land at a time and passes. Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like fair magic. And then all I'm of people of you. I'll let you get in on the vibe soon. Look at my commander. I got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm going to play Daxos, Bust by the Sun. All right. Mm, then I'll sh shiny hot Daxos. Island go. <laughs> Wow, my turns are wild over here. The most powerful card in Magic right there, right? Turn uh, one health. Do this, that, that. Far seek this, that. Island, your turn. <laughs> I guess we'll we'll get Omnath out. Uh, oh, already? Yeah, he's a, he's a one one. It's totally fine and fair. Uh, and I'll yeah, pass. Good All thing right. nothing ever nothing bad ever happens when an Omnath goes on chat. <laughs> I think that's my yeah. favorite thing about it. <laughs> I'm gonna pay two life, and then I'm gonna cast my commander. And so when we go to my end step, I'm gonna draw a card. Then yep. uh, you guys can draw a card or play a land. I get to do both. I'm gonna play a land. land. Play Myriad Landscape. And, play right, force. Land. and I'll pass after that. Sweet. So untap. Draw, that's perfect, because that solved all my questions about what I was going to do this turn. I'm going to play a forest. I'm going to play hardened scales. Nice. And then I'm going to tap and sack the myriad landscape to go get two forests. Uh, in response, I'll do the same thing. Okay. <laughs> and you said you're done after that? Yep, yep. Nothing else to do. All right, then. It's time to party, I think. Maybe. 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 We'll see. We'll see what my deck allows me to do. <laughs> all right. So I will untap. Draw. Um is land and uh i'm gonna play cherix oh boy huh <laughs> your turn huh love it all right at the end of your turn i'm gonna tap to add one to my mana pool uh and then we'll untap here and draw okay uh hmm. the big crab which one of these puts a bigger target on my back <laughs> Uh, well, I think I have the biggest target, right? I have a zero you, 17. Yeah, uh, that is true. You have the biggest back, I guess. Um, yeah, I do. I, that I do. Well, let's 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 chat. Um, how do people feel about Krim's favorite card in the world? Oh, don't tell me. Oh, come oh. on. Oh, I hate that card so much. Well, surely what could go wrong? What could go let's wrong see. in an Omnath deck? Could go wrong. It'll be fine. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be friendly. I'm not going to attack anybody. I'm just going to pass. I'm just going to okay. just double your mana. I'm just going to double my mana. It's okay. That's fine. Does yeah. anybody want to deal with that? <laughs> I, I, once I see Anissa, I have very much so tunnel vision. There is only one thing I want to do. I don't care if I can kill somebody. That's great. But I need to kill Nissa. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, that's that's fair. I kind of figured I would get this out of the way because, uh, yep. I'm going to play a Curse of Opulence hey. and I'm going to play it on Chris. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like Chris. Reasonable. I, I just want to get through a game without ruining Chris's day. But it's <laughs> no, not no, no, that's Chris fair. is Anissa, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I <laughs> did this to me. <laughs> okay. I'm going to play Nature's Lore. Go find that real quick because it's untapped. Uh, actually, I don't care that it's untapped. All right. Shuffle my library. And yeah, I'm gonna pass the turn. Go to my end step. Everyone can draw a card or play land. I will do both. I'm gonna draw a card. I'll draw a card. I didn't hit I my will land. Play a ghost quarter. Great. You feel free to blow up my lands. It's mostly it's mostly blast zone protection, so you're you're fine. Uh, Unless you play blast zone. I... 
turn. I am very sad. There is a Nissa, and there is not anything I can do about it. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to play a Plains. And so I'm going to play, let's see, three to play a Ronus's Monument. Sweet. Cool. And then with the reduced cost, uh, I'm going to go ahead and play my commander. I'm going to play Lathiel, the Bounteous Dawn. Ito. And yeah. so well, Lathiel's going to enter. I'm going to gain a life thanks to Daxos. Uh, and then I'm going to go to my end step. Lathiel's going to trigger. And thanks to Hardened Scales, I'm going to put two 1-1 one, one counters on Daxos. Nice. Okay. That's pretty sweet. That's my turn. We're not attacking the Nissa. It's cool. It's, uh, it's fine. Oh, it was, I only had two power like during my combat phase. Oh, so. oh right, 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 right. No one has killed Nissa with me. It's cool. 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 cool. Um, all right. I'm going to play an island. And then, to nobody's you... surprise, I'm attacking the. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Uh, so you have. So you pay five. And it becomes a 512, right? I pay three. I pay three. three and it becomes six power. Oh, oh, you have six. You have six lands available. Never mind. Um, six is. Uh, man, I really wanted her to live for a little while. Um, no. But I don't want to lose a land. <laughs> yep. 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 I will. I'll let it happen. You're going to pump? Yep. Uh, you get a treasure and I get a treasure. Uh, Heck in... yeah. I, you didn't even have to give me that treasure. I was already ah. going to swing that way. <laughs> Mara, Mara, thank you so much for the raid. Thank you. How, hey, how did this thing go? Um, so I'm actually, in, in response to the, to the pump, I'm going to tap the forest for two, two green mana. And this oh, is no. gone. All right. Is that it? Do you have something in your second main? Oh, yes, I do. Oh, um, let me see. Okay. Tap so... three and celebrate. <laughs> Come... Hey, hey lady. Lady. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to get a drink. See, there it is. And just like every anime, friendship is <laughs> the real treasure. Is <laughs> the real treasure, yep. <laughs> um, and then we're going to go ahead and play Baron, Talarian Archmage. I'm going to bounce your Omnath. Yeah, okay. That's fair. And then it's uh, your turn. Yep. So I lose the um, the floating on math mana. We will untap and draw. Well, uh, yeah. Let's. Well, we killed Nissa, so I did my job. You sure did. I was uh... never hired. I never got a W four. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm willing to 1099 you if you're... <laughs> <laughs> if it ever becomes a Nissa again. Zendikar resurgent. Oh. Oh, magic All gathering. Right. Uh, All right. Yeah. Totally fair and reasonable. And we are now. Yeah, you, that that's what we call an esports move right there chris that's an esports move i and i played a rogues passage by the way uh and then uh yeah i'm gonna pass i present to you and i'm gonna run my dog out i will be right back all right Hmm. so uh what up team you gonna (laughs) we're we're a team now remember that everybody we're a team (laughs) remember friends is the treasure it's the real treasure i don't have to be convinced Um, I'm going to do an incredibly boring move. Uh, I'm going to tap six and crack a treasure. If Chris wants to react to this later, I encourage him to. Cast Brass's Bounty. So you're making a lot of friends. Yeah. Because that's a lot of treasure. Make six Uh, treasure. uh, How much damage am I taking? (laughs) (laughs) What? So I cast Brass's Bounty and made six treasures. Uh, And that is all I'm going to do. I'm going to go to my instep, draw a card or play a land, everybody. Draw a card. Uh, I would like to... I'll draw. Play a land, everybody. <laughs> Putting a breeding pool in tapped. That's it. Okay, sweet. I'm going to untap. I'm going to draw for turn. Oh, all right. I'm going to pay two to play uh, Swiftfoot Boots. And I'm going to pay one to equip Swiftfoot Boots to Lathiel. Giving Lathiel Hexproof in haste. All right. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to play... I'm going to play Conclave Mentor. Ooh. So I'm going to gain a life. You got a stew going. All right. There's a lot of stuff going <laughs> on over there. That's true. Uh, Ronus's My... Monument is going to be bigger. Yeah. And I'm going to put the plus two, plus two, and trample on Lathiel. Hi. Um, so, Chris, I'm going to swing you for four, Lifelink yeah. Commander. No blocks. You got it. I take uh, four. And so you make a treasure, and I make a treasure. That's true. I get a treasure. Uh, for the moment, I'm going to use this leaf, and then I will do a infinite tokens in a second. Um, and then I'm going to go to my uh, I'm going to go to my end step. Lathiel is going to trigger, and so I've got five life, five counters to distribute. Um, but so hardened scales and conclave mentor are going to tr- combine. They're each going to add one. Um, so I'm going to put three of the counters on conclave mentor. Just going to make five, and I'm going to put two of the counters on Daxos. Just going to make four. I really thought I was the counters deck, but I guess not. <laughs> and <laughs> and uh, that's my end. That's my turn. All right, I'll untap the big crab. Is ready to party. Um, all right, I'm going to soul ring. Ooh, nice. Then I'm going to attack Chris. 
<laughs> Actually, hold on. Before I attack, before I attack okay. Chris, hold on. Let's change. Let's change that real quick. Uh, three. Okay. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna G Diddy. I'm gonna play Gadwick. Nice. Uh, for three, using a treasure, and then so I'll draw three. I'll play an Island, and uh, if you need some manas, you can attack Chris. That's I, true. I would like to actually. Um, you you should drive a very hard bargain. I, I like that. I like that a lot actually. You know what I'm gonna do, Chris? I'm just gonna hit you for two. Yeah, I appreciate that. And I'm gonna get that. a treasure. No problem. So that is uh, and then that is two damage. I'm going to cast Sakashima, copying Cherix. Okay. Uh, how does Sakashima <laughs> read? Okay. Um. So Copy the legendary rule no longer applies. Gotcha. To me. I was reading the first ability actually. But... Oh right. Uh Got yeah. It. Copies right. another creature I control. Nothing that you control. Right. And uh, that'll uh, allow me to tap something down. Uh, I'll, I'll, I don't know. I'll tap down Clay's treasure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Pass. Yeah, your turn. Sweet. Let's uh, let's untap here and draw. Uh, okay. Uh, so this is gonna look way scarier than it actually is, but there's no way for me to convince you <laughs> that it isn't scary. So we're just gonna opener. we're just gonna do it. We're just gonna do it. It's gonna be fun. It's a very strong opener. <laughs> I'm not afraid of anything, so try me. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna tap two lands and float one green mana, and I'm gonna Kadama's Reach. So far, so okay. Uh, let's go get two basics. Green playing and green magic. One taps. One in my hands. Um, and I already played that for us. Stack. Did I miscalculate? I don't think so. Um, uh, I don't think there's anything on the stack for you to miscalculate. Right, right. Yeah, you have a point. Um, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> uh, actually, yeah. I have the Lanowar Elf for a green. Um, I don't. Well, I guess wait, you miscalculate. You don't need to tap all that for Kadama's Reach, right? Is that a card resurgent? I have to tap Ooh. two lands for it. This is right. the one that came in tapped from the Kadama's Reach. Oh, okay. okay. So you have one yeah. floating. That's right. Okay. I, I have I have one floating. Yeah. Um, and that's that. Like that's why I was doing the math. Um, so I have one floating. I'm gonna tap the Ghost Quarter for two to play Omnath, and I will. Draw <laughs> from Zendikar Resurgent later. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> Looks good. And then I'm going to tap four and five because this doesn't get doubled. Right. For a Seedborn Muse. And I'll draw <laughs> again <laughs> for the Zendikar Resurgent. And then it's I will. Okay. It's not that bad, right, Chris? It's not. That, it, it, <laughs> okay. All right. So here's the thing is that this deck wins on sor at sorcery speed. I don't have any any instant interaction except for like two removals. Talk about the so, pinnacle? Yeah. Uh, no, no There's pinnacle. There is a counter spell um, that <laughs> is its Veil of Summer, believe it or not. Okay. There's a ram through. That's about it, instant speed wise. So, uh, like I said, this looks way scarier than it is. Uh -huh. But <laughs> before I pass, I'm going to float four mana and then I will pass over to Jake and then I will untap right. everything, shuffle, Strong. and draw my two cards. Strong the, play, uh, strong play. Jake, I'm just going to cut off that card draw to, to Chris. <laughs> oh, player <laughs> removal is totally vi viable, and I don't doubt that I'm like dead in two turns or something. I think we're going to have to start hitting with some crabs. Yeah. We're going to play a Red Door Fitter Foundry, and let's see. This reads. Look, it, this, looks like a, this looks like you're at, we're at DEF CON 5, but like, or whatever, right? This looks it's like, like we're, we're... I, I would say this is an Avengers level threat. <laughs> <laughs> like, right. Yeah. This is now officially an Avengers level threat. <laughs> right, right, right. An Avengers level threat, but it's not. But like, this isn't Thanos bad. Like, this is this is first Avengers movie. Uh, oh, is it? So ali just ali is alien inv invasion of New York. Okay. Yeah. Okay, this is just Shikari and Loki. Yeah. Okay. Right. Exactly. Worm coil engine. Okay. Ooh. And seeing as, seeing as how what we're doing, I feel like this is a Thanos level threat. <laughs> I'm just cloning big chariots. <laughs> that's the whole point. <laughs> all right. Uh, so that's all I'm going to do. Go to my end step. Everyone draw a card or play land. Uh, at the end of your turn, I will tap so much mana. Two, four, six, eight, <laughs> and 12. I still need to draw Strong. two cards from the Zendikar. Uh, and I will put a force into play. So I will I'm putting add... a maze of it into play. That is a very <laughs> good call. <laughs> And then, yeah, all right. So you pass over to Clay, and I untap with Clay. How big is Omnath? A 1717 right now. Very good, very good, very good, very good, very good. So I will draw for turn. Uh, all right. Uh, so I will play a planes. Oh, yeah, that's right. I get to t untap my treasure. <laughs> yeah. We got Clay. We got Clay, though. Clay had that one mana spell, yeah. but no longer. Uh, so let's see. So two less, three less. So one green white to play uh, Hamza, Guardian of Arishan. 
Cool. Dope. Uh, so I'm going to gain a life. If you follow this up with an Armageddon, I wouldn't even be mad. <laughs> I, no, I am not running Armageddon. And if you jump on the fast, you work. Uh, and then I'm going to, let's see, so Hamza reduces the cost by two. Krim, what if I what if I make my make it so my Omnath can never gain unblockable? How does that sound? I'm... <laughs> like, I mean, we have, it seems like we have a multitude of ways of losing. <laughs> okay. uh, I'm also just hurt that you would invite me to the show and then cast Nissa. <laughs> you would invite me here. And you, you knew he was coming. You can't. Yeah, you're right. And you put yeah. an elixir in game one, so you pre-boarded twice. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah. Uh, that is 100% what happened. Twice. Uh, so I'm going to cast Juniper Order Ranger. I'm going to get another life. Uh, and so, sorry, so both the Ronus Monument um, pumps went on to Lathiel. Mm -hmm. uh, but unfortunately, there's now no good attack since Omnath's so big. Until I can try. make... I could, I could try, but until I can make a Lathiel unblockable, that train has left the station. So we're going to go ahead, go to our end step. Uh, so I've got two two life gain triggers to distribute. Um, and so we're going to go ahead and put two counters on each of Hamza and Juniper Order Ranger. I'm going to tap everything and go up to 31 floating green mana. Absolutely. For sure. <laughs> For sure. Okay. <laughs> and I will untap with Krim. Uh, right, right. No, of course. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, of yeah. course. Guess what? Nobody cares. Nobody cares. <laughs> Stop okay. announcing it, I guess. I say i slightly care but yeah yeah okay so i've drawn a card for turn i'd like to play an island so hypothetically if i could copy that said card <laughs> that seedborn muse over there i Frank, would then that'd be great you would then untap <laughs> all the time i would all the time and i do like untapping all the time so how about this i play mirage mirror Ooh, yeah does that work the way i think it does it'll then oh i don't think there's an opportunity is there no because no you there's it. not um oh, there isn't Oop. Because you do it at the beginning of the end step, right? And then it resets priority and then it goes away. Um, oh, no, 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 no. I would do it on like, so example, I would then play, I would copy the Seedborn Muse, right? Because your Seedborn Muse trigger would go on the stack, right? Or no, no, right. your untap would the never. The beginning of the untap doesn't exist anymore. Yeah. Okay. So that does not do what I want it to do, is what I'm being told. Mm. B1 uh -huh. lover, thank you for the thank you for the follow, friend. Still got that Cherix, though. I do. I do. You do? I do, don't I? Um, all right. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get a little saucy, anyways. Um, I'm sorry. There's a there's a slight error. What what happened? I accidentally moved your okay. life total. It is, it oh, is that's sick. cool. That's chill. That's chill. That's chill. Oh, but Chris, you need to move the uh, commander damage. Oh yeah, you're right. I will do that too. Thank you. Um, I will now politely, very ever ever so politely, uh, go to my end step. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh. I will send Omnath up to, I just did this math. I, I think it's 46, right? Um, 14, yeah, 15. We're gonna uh, we're gonna simplify that math. So now you're really? floating. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna overload Cyclonic Rift. Yeah, that's fair. Or right. try to. Uh, hmm. Not a lot of like I can't do anything about that. I don't have uh, I don't have that counter spell in hand. So. Uh... And then I will use this to tap down because uh, Gadwick. I will tap down <laughs> uh, your, your a, a treasure of Jake's. <laughs> All right, consider them all tapped down, I suppose. No, just I wonder. Just, they are just, all going to go away. Yep. Everything goes back to my hand. Oh, actually, this this forest stays because it is a land. Correct. Actually, the I'm going to crack seven of them for red. And then, oh, wait, I got some stuff I could do, I think. No, it wouldn't matter. I'm going to crack it for seven red. <laughs> And that's it. So that then it goes to your turn. Alrighty, untap here and then draw. I just keep drawing the dumbest shit, uh, and I feel really bad playing it uh, because. Do that, Krim. <laughs> Look, I'm gonna. I'm just trying to make some big crabs. All right, and I'm just gonna try to punch. <laughs> I got a pinch. All right. Got a pinch. Crabs got a pinch. <laughs> I guess I can't hold that against you. We're not here to block with them. That's for sure. Next blue mansion. Oh, Chris, so hard. Okay. That's a big baby. <laughs> It's a, it's a big baby. Uh, pass. Uh, wait, no, hold on. No, I can't really hit Krim for three. I'll pass. You sure right. can. <laughs> like, yeah, uh, but I mean, you can block with Cherix. I sure can. <laughs> Tap one, play the Retrofitter Foundry. Double Tap block. six, uh, cast Rampaging Bayloths. Oh, and then I'll play a Marsh Flats and get me a fella. And then I will pass the turn. All right. All righty. Untap and get ready to discard most of our hand. All right. Um. So let's see. Hardened scales. Daxos. 
Conclave Mentor, Gain a Life, uh, Swift Foot Boots. Hey, I've only got to discard one card. Is that bad? There you go. Uh, I'll discard Realm Seekers. All right. Best turn. Okay, I'll draw. I will play an Island. I will tap Soul Ring an Isle, or tap Soul Ring to turn Mirage Mirror into the Ancient. Yeah. Yes. All right. So now we're going to. I can activate it again after, right? Okay, cool. Uh, then I'm going mm, to go ahead and you pay. You can. Um, so Mirage Mirror pay. loses the loses the copy ability. Oh, okay, cool. It's end of turn, but that that that's fine. I mean, I don't. Wait, couldn't you stack it in such a way that it's like that briefly? You had let it resolve. And yeah, then tap right? all your Can't mana. I? Yeah, so you can yeah, you yeah. can tap hold priority, ta activate it twice, tap all of your mana after okay. the second activation resolves. Um, okay. So then I would, but then I would want it so that the the ancient resolves first. Right. Yeah. So, so you would spend four mana attack. total. Yeah. So so here it is. This is one two right, and then there's another two, but yeah. that that doesn't actually. Make Make any sense i don't need to do that or but i could actually you know what i will i will do that all right so the first thing i'm gonna copy or like it, like so i want it to end where my mirror is going to be cherix yeah yeah okay so that's how i'm stacking it but i but then i'm gonna float all this mana first right so three six nine twelve fifteen eighteen but i yeah. don't need that much actually so i only need three because i don't have that much to do uh three six all right, so that's that's a total of nine, nine, three, six, nine. I can go ahead now and float that. So that's all the mana, three, six, nine. Then I can do this, this, this. So that leaves me with a total of six afterwards. I don't need six after. I only need, yeah, I do. Oh, actually, no, I do need because it's three to activate each time. Yeah, okay. So uh, I'll float. I have six mana here, or I have nine mana here, and I have another nine mana here. I have potentially six mana up, right? Uh, so okay, so that'll all now resolve, and this will be a this will be a crab. I'll play Mirror Gallery. I'll play Solemn, and I'll use the six or the nine left up after that to give Mirage Mirror, Cherix, and Sakashima, who's also a Cherix, yeah. uh, the ability to go ahead and pump, and then we attack all of this at Chris. I was just say, if you kill me, you don't get you don't get to uh, triple your mana anymore. Well, you know, I need you to block. So <laughs> I know, <laughs> and uh, yeah. So uh, ooh. how much? How much is that? That is how many islands do you have? Three, six, nine, ten, eleven. That is thirty-three. It's thirty-three. Can I go to one? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I can't. I don't have like. I have. Okay, yeah, that is fair. I have done it before. That is true. Um. I'll block one with the forest, and I will go yep. down to twelve. Yeah. All <laughs> right. All right. I, uh, I've been twenty-two. You've been pinched. And yeah, the pinches, yeah. and I get a treasure. <laughs> oh wait, no, I don't. That's no, gone. Your that's turn. gone. Oh yeah, you're right. I need to take the. I need to move that away. All right, Friendship, cool. nope. That's a lot of pinches. That is many pinches. All right, let's uh, <laughs> let's untap <laughs> here. Yeah, that is true. Uh, well, I guess we can gain some life. Yes, I pay three for a courser of crucifix. Mm -hmm. Flip the top card of my library is a song of the dryads. Uh, wow, which means I can't play it. And you know, it's one of the most frustrating, but like one of my one of the best green commander only cards. I think. Yeah, his song. I think it was only commander. Was it? I think so. Um, I I feel no sympathy <laughs> for for green. <laughs> Green is so good. I'm there. sure we're still dead. I feel like we are still close to dead. No, no, you're fine. Um, I'm gonna play this. I'm gonna play Omnath. Oh, I still have my Nyx Bloom Ancient. Hold on. Holy crap. Mm -hmm. Never mind. You might you're be dead. Um, uh, all right. So this is the Corsair. This is Omnath. Uh, I guess since I have triple. Oh, that's all right. We won't walk anything back. Um, this is Seedborn Muse Floating One. This is use one of that for Lanawar Elves and. And three for lightning greaves. I'll move to put the greaves onto the Omnath. Okay. So I have one floating. Seems good. Uh, okay. So how do I not die this next turn? Nobody knows. Uh, six, seven, or three, six, seven, Zendikar Resurgent. So I just dump my entire hand and pass, I guess. Okay. Uh, I'm going to tutor for this. Comes in tapped. Then I'll uh, get another beast and untap draw. Okay. Play a wooded foothills. Hmm. I'm going to need to copy that rogue's passage. <laughs> yeah, you are. Am I going to ghost quarter my own rogue's passage? <laughs> With the trigger oh, on the stack. Man. 
<laughs> oh boy. I guess if I if I do it, I have to do it before you untap, right? Because uh, you can yeah, just because then I can activate it again. Yeah, because you can keep activating it. Oh no. <laughs> uh... So uh I'm gonna let you decide that now, but I think you know where a big crab is going. <laughs> yeah, I sure do. Uh let's just do this now. <laughs> we're, we're doing it. Somebody's getting pinched if you don't do it. <laughs> All right, cast All my right. commander. Uh, I'm going to crack this for something that taps for red, taking three. Cast Curse of Opulence on Chris. Yeah, please. <laughs> That's fair. One mana, three treasure. It sounds pretty good. All right. I love it. And then I'm going to pass the turn. Um, All right, at the end of your turn, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What's eight times four? 32. Uh, 30, 32. All right, I'm going to float 32 mana and then on top of Clay. For sure. All right, so we yeah. uh, all draw a card or play a land. I get to do both. Draw, draw a card. Uh, I will draw a card when I'm done shuffling. Uh, I will on tap, and then I will draw. All right, so I'm going to play a planes for turn. How do we... Just remember, the crabs are... The crab people are your friends. <laughs> that is true. Yeah, there's not, a lot, there's not a lot I can do about them. I can block a little bit, but eventually all my all my fun stuff will die. Uh, Quote, unquote. We'll see. Do you have a fog? Nope. Is more, uh, so uh, morally objecting to fogs. Um, oh, man, do we still have that clip? As yeah, you... of course. Fog. Uh, so I'm gonna pay one. I'm gonna play Sacred Cat. Uh, so I'll gain a life. Daxos. Solid. Uh, and then we'll do three for Ronus's monument, and we'll do three for Lathiel. I'll pay one to go to equip Lathiel with Swiftfoot Boots. And so I gained life from Lathiel as well. Uh, yeah. And then that's our turn. I've got two life gain triggers um, from Lathiel. So we're going to put two counters are going to go on Sacred Cat. And two counters are going to go on Conclave Mentor. I'm going to go up to 64. I'm going to draw for turn. I have now drawn that magical card. Uh, okay. So how do we go about this? All right. First thing is... All right, we'll go. We'll do the thing. So I'm gonna pay four mana, right? I'm gonna have it so that it ends with. Uh, actually, do I need to do that? I don't think I have to. I can just play. I can have this become Zendikar Resurgent. Oh, okay. yeah. That draws. Me, that doesn't triple my mana though, and I do like tripling my mana. <laughs> triple, triple is more than double. <laughs> yeah, triple is a lot more than double, but drawing but, cards is a very cool feature. Yeah, I was about to say, you get to draw a card if you cast a creature. I will definitely copy Zendikar Resurgent. I think double is more than enough. Triple is just greedy. Um, I'm going to evoke Moldrifter with one Ooh. floating. So I'll draw one. Uh, Gadwick will trigger. Yeah. I'm going to I'm gonna go ahead and tap down your Omnath. It's got Shroud. Oh, it's got Shroud? Then just kidding. I'm going to tap down your uh, your 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 land of war elf i was gonna say my like my next blue mansion is the biggest next biggest thing thing after yeah but i want you to block with that so yeah yeah i would too i'm gonna and so then uh, I'll, yeah that's this will evoke so i now draw two right and then i'll that dies i will play my land for turn then let's see here, how do we go about this i think we might be able to tap down your entire board except for something but except you can take me for out. this you're, you're gonna <laughs> You're gonna win the favor of the table, but you have to make sure that they're not gonna like come after you next. You do have so many crabs. Right, right, team, right, team. Uh, yeah, I'm not too worried about having to make deals with anyone. Okay, <laughs> people right. gotta do what they gotta do. <laughs> like that. So I've got one floating, so I'll use that one floating and two more. Uh, so then that's two, four, five, five total. I'm gonna play body double. Um, so yeah, it's gonna trigger. I guess what creatures are in the graveyard right now? None for me. You have none, so I'll just copy gladly copy uh, Mole Drifter, and she's a creature. And then I'm gonna tap down your uh, your Courser, yeah. and I'll draw that. Oh, then I'll Sorry, just... it'll it'll then enter the battlefield. I'll draw two more. T top and... card of my library for the Courser is a Bane of Progress. And I guess you get no. to see what card I drew off of K and T, which was a command tower. Let's make it saucy. So whenever I cast a blue spell, all right, all right, I'll play Glen Alendra. Tap down your uh, five five. Yee. And that'll draw another card because of this Zendikar Resurgent that you were so generous to let me use. I do what I can. And, uh, like, we, we have to kill the Omnath, right? Uh, oh, no, 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 that's fair. But I mean, like, I don't have, I have Sorcery Speed Trample, but I don't have a way to do it in, at instance. So I just have one big, one really big creature and a bunch of mana. Sorry. <laughs> and a Bane of Progress, which would really, really hamstring me here. So I'm probably not playing it. 65, 65, yeah. 
He was very big. We have a 65 65. I, I just don't see how we don't kill you. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. That's okay. I forgive you. I, I, I think, yeah, I have to. I'm going to attack, right? You have... I have two blockers. You have two crabs? Yeah, well, kind of. We'll see. Um, this is going to feel weird. Two, four, six. Two, four, six. So, I mean, I just need to cast one spell. All right, so we'll do this for one, two, three, four. I'm going to cast Blue Sun Zenith. Yeah. Tap down, uh, the, seaborn tap down the Seaborn. And I'll do it for... So, I'll do it for one. So, I'll draw. Yeah. Hang on. Uh, Wait. Uh, so, which which one are you? Or am I not drawing? As it's not. You're I mean, not like, drawing. Okay, that, that's fine. Uh, but like, I am tapping down, right? Wait, yeah, what? The cast. Oh yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm gonna cast yeah. deflecting spot and take however many cards that was. One, one. Oh, drat. A card for a card. Um, and so now I'll go to combat. I'll swing with Cherix and Sakashima, who is Cherix. You get And they're it. both very big. I guess I'll go up which to one? 90, 96 mana and yeah. then block. Uh, so if I kill Cherix, then if you guys bounce Sakashima or kill Sakashima, there won't be another Cherix. So I will I do you all a favor uh, on your way out. Oh, yeah, I guess it's true. Well, that's fine. I will I will block uh, actual Cherix uh, with okay. the 97, 97 on math, and then I am. I, I believe that is good enough to take down our crustacean I, friend. I think so. <laughs> and... Uh, I think that's it. That's your turn. It's perfect. All right, cool. So over to Sorry, over to Jim. No, 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 no. I I came out I came out of the gate way stronger than I expected to, and I was just like, well, I can't not play these cards, right? Uh, so you attacked with two creatures, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's for each creature, right? Curse of Opulence. I'm not sure, actually. Because uh, it says whenever uh, enchanted player is attacked, create a colorless artifact. Doesn't say with one or more creatures. Oh, okay. Then yeah, two treasures. Hell, hell, heck yeah! All right, party yeah. up. Yeah. All right, untap, draw. Uh, you guys have many lands. Do you? Two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How many lands do you guys have? Oh, sorry. The Scryfall says that it triggers only once, no matter how many creatures are attacking. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Okay. So then, JK, just kidding. All right. Just kidding out loud on the just floor. Just kidding out loud. Lol. <laughs> yeah, the green player had to go for it. I have oh, no, no bias. One hundred percent. I have no bias here. Totally. <laughs> Okay, uh, I am going to five mana left after that. I'm going to play yeah, totally. Helm of the Host. Oh, All right. that's I'm going to tap five and equip it to my commander. Oh, <laughs> lordy. Wait, hold on. You have a Helm of the Host? Hold on, hold on. That's a non-creature spell. It is. But I, uh, what if I promise to put it in a nice place? Oh, Lands and cards. What are you kidding me? Jake. I, you want lender? I, I would feel bad if I did. I wouldn't. You know what? Don't pull any punches. If I, w I would go for it. Don't if pull it's, any pinches. I, I, won't pinch pull, any I, won't, I won't pull any pinches. All right. I'll use the treasure All and right. I'll counter that. All right. That gets countered. So I got five mana left. Um, Let's do that. Actually, I'll do that. Okay, I'm going to cast three visits and land tax. So, leaving two mana up and tutor for a forest, any old forest, USA, and put that in play. Then we're going to go to my end step. Everyone can draw a card or play a land. I'm going to draw a card. Um, I'll draw a card. But only one time because I guess uh, fun isn't on the table today. Oh, oh, oh. The fun oh, police oh, had to oh, come oh, through oh. with his Glenelandra. <laughs> And spend a Sunday ruining everybody's time. I'm gonna untap. If I recall, I was deflecting swatted for one. <laughs> of all number two for one. I couldn't even Kermit's have like, a four mana opt. <laughs> can, can can we get the transcript? I'm pretty sure that <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. It was like roll roll the tape back. I roll need to point back. out. I recall you must be speaking in the third person. <laughs> Alrighty, so just gonna continue playing cards we've already seen. Oh, uh, yeah. Fight for Hamza, Guardian of Ereshin. And then as a result, so that's two and then three again. So green white to play uh, Juniper Order Ranger. And then uh, so two counters, so it's minus two. Uh, I guess. We'll do this, and we'll play. Uh, we'll play Absan Battle Priest. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Another life. Jake has a whole bunch of beasts. All right. Very, sad, very sad robot. Very sad robot. Alrighty. End step. Uh, I have three life gain. I gained three life, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna distribute those. But Hardened Scales and Conclave Mentor are gonna make each of those three, and that's my turn. Okay. Uh, I am only down to one crab now, but I guess mirror image changes that. So, uh, 
six, nine, twelve. How big are what's your biggest creature, uh Clay? Uh eight. Eight. An eight eight right now. Jeez. Ooh. Um One, okay. two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. And then Daxos is a two eight as well. I guess I'll just cycle this desert of the mindful. All right, that's a card. I will play an island. Got to be careful now how many islands I play. We are getting to the territory where I just might kill my own crab. Um, <laughs> so that's that's a 13 power crab currently. Um, you know what? I'll just pay two with the soul ring. I'll go ahead and put lightning greaves on the board if that's cool with everyone. Wait, do you have 13 islands? I do. 13 just actual islands. Oh, my land tax is actually going to trigger. That's crazy. Well, no, I have I have it now. I do right. now. Okay. Yeah, but on my upkeep, I'm going to have to go get stuff. I didn't anticipate that all right um and then i play the greaves the greaves will then allow me to go ahead and just equip that to sakashima and uh i'm gonna pass or let me see three yeah i guess i'm just gonna pass all righty uh i'm doing my upkeep land tax trigger getting three lands to my hand and on your end step crack the flooded strand it comes in tapped going to 32 all right Untap. Oh, wait. Also, retrofitter foundry. Make a servo token. We got the engine moving here. We're is going that for... What's that? Is retrofitter foundry the hidden commander? No, you still <laughs> haven't seen it, sadly. Every time I tutor, I look at it and I'm like, come on, would you just get to the top of this deck? All right. Still nothing. Playing a planes for turn. Getting a beast. I got a beast from the uh, steam vent centering as well. Seven beasts, please. And then three, four, six, seven, eight. I'm going to tap eight, and I will cast Udvara Hellkite. Oh, okay. <laughs> so now whenever a dragon you control attacks, you get a dragon, yeah? That's right. Okay. Uh, well, gang, there's a lot of scary stuff out there. Yeah, yeah. We've like got a board. I'm going to tap four and play a solemn tutor for a land. That'll trigger a the beast. The saddest of robots. The saddest of the robots. And one, that one actually oh, just that looks is? way more sad than the one mine, mine is. Mine looks like sad, but... Not that sad. Mine's yeah, hurt. This one looks yeah. real. This one looks like, like the, the, the sun is setting. It is real sad in that photo. A curse goes away. Um, I'm de dumb. I don't think I can do anything interesting. So I'm going to pass the turn and I'll get that land. All right. And that uh, can't eat you. And that's going to trigger Right. right. I'll, um, I'll put a land. All right. So my basic is going to trigger. Uh, and then so is my land from Kneos and Tiro. Right. So I've got 10 beasts. Yeesh. All right. So we untap, we draw. All right. Um, hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What are we going to do? All right, let's start. We're going to play a Sylvan Library. Oh, I have no counter magic except for this Glen. So <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think that is what I would not counter. <laughs> and then that's, that's right. for green, we're going to play an Orin Refuse. All Can't right. Wait pretty rad that's the ooze right that's the it's the one that uh puts a woman counter on it or when yeah. it enters, counter and then when it attacks put a woman counter on everything that's sweet okay um, but it's actually going to get three two three counters thanks to conclave mentor and harden scales um and i gained the life for that and then we're going to um or pay one in a white we're gonna play Dawn of Hope. I got to stay here. That's the one that activates for soldiers. Uh, so whenever I gain life, I may pay two. If I do draw a card, three and a white, create a soldier with life link. Yeah. Uh, and then I'm going to a one for a loyal unicorn. Y'all. <laughs> life. Look, Dawn of Hope's gonna trigger. I'm going to pay to draw. Uh, and then I'm gonna play a Grape Health Refuge. So I'll gain a life. Three. Uh, and so now we're going to go to combat. Loyal Unicorn is going to trigger. Uh, so it's going to prevent all combat damage that would be dealt to creatures I control. Um, and they gain vigilance until out of turn. Okay. Um, and so the easiest way, so these, all the ones with counters have lifelink on them. So I actually need to keep track of this. We already gained three life. And then, so we're going to say Lathiel, Sacred Cat, and Conclave Mentor are going to attack Krim and Abzan Battle Priest, Junipor Order Ranger, and Hamza are going to attack Jake. So it's two, five, and seven. No, nine. Nine going at Krim and six, 11, uh, 19 going at Jake. Okay. I'm gonna... uh, yeah, responses, I guess, around the table, right? So I, I would I would have to respond first, yeah? Yep. Uh, well, table probably won't be happy, but I'm going to evacuation. I'll return everything to our hands. All, all creatures. 
All creatures. Let me see. Ooh. And then I'll tap down your maze of it. Uh, hmm. Hate that. <laughs> uh, yeah. I can't do anything about that. Alrighty. Yeah, that sucks. All right. Um, this is actually in the graveyard. This is not in my hand. Uh, it's a body double. Yeah. What? What? Uh, like what? Right as you're attacking, it's like, oh, I, I think it could just make the math easier. But we'll see how much you send at me. <laughs> I say I didn't send that much. I thought. <laughs> no, 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 no. All right. Well, that's my. Uh, that is my turn. Okay. So with that now in mind. We have, I'm going to play an island. I'm going to play body double to copy Cherix in the graveyard. Three, five, four, five. Then I'm going to pay one, two, three, four. Play. Never, never agreed to any such thing, Clay, but I will do what I can. She will track you down. <laughs> she knows I will where I play live. Sakashima to copy the Cherix that's, uh, or the, the body double that is a Cherix. I will move the Greaves over uh, to to Sakashima, and then, let me see here, three, six, eight, okay, so then I will pay three to then make Sakashima, or like my Cherix, be able to actually deal damage. Um, I'm going to attack, I guess, Jake, so that's... Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, fifteen commander damage. And that's you're just attacking me with the one. Yeah, just the one because I I don't think I can. If I move, actually, hold on. If I move this over, no, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. No. Yeah, just the one. Just the one. All right, I'm gonna crack this tap to make a servo and block. Ugh, right. You can make a servo. Okay, so that means Sakashima's got one damage mark on it, and then I will pay four, and I'll play. Glenelendra, mm -hmm. your turn. All right, untap and draw. Okay. Hmm. All right, I'm going to tap six and cast Rampaging Bailoths. Yup. I'm going to play my land for turn. Get a baby, baby Bailoth. Yup. Ba Give me them baby, 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 baby. Baby back bailouts. Brutal. <laughs> yep. Clay gets bounced again. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's yep. a... I'm going to play a Worm Coil Engine. Yup. Yup. Oof. And then I'm going to pass the turn all right we're gonna <laughs> rebuild we can rebuild clay we can rebuild we can do it um so upkeep excuse me draw i've actually got the sylvan library trigger y'all uh gobble those cards up take the life <laughs> you didn't have like 12 cards in hand already yeah, if, I hadn't, if i hadn't just <laughs> just <laughs> had 10 great cards put back in my hand um so we'll put we'll put those back on top like that and then, so we're going to play a Plains Return. We're going to start with, let's see, start with Daxos. <laughs> I think I've seen Daxos before. <laughs> a few times. We're going to do what? Conclave Mentor. Yeah. The resilience of this board is so beautiful. We're going <laughs> to yeah. do... I did nothing. I was just like, all right, well, everybody's back to normal. We're going to do Last <laughs> Well. Um... <laughs> Uh, we're going to play Sacred Cat. <laughs> yup. Um, we're going to pay one to equip Swift Foot Boots to Lathio. And we're going to pay one for, uh, we're going to pay one for Elixir of Immortality in case everything <laughs> is destroyed versus bounced. Um, okay. And then, uh, end step, I've got three life gain triggers. Yup. You have so much life. I am never killing you. <laughs> We're going to do that. That is my turn. <laughs> I've oh. replayed my hand. I will draw for turn. Yep. I'll play a war room. And now, now I've got too much land. Um, <laughs> pile that. <laughs> God, shit is so real right now. How many cards does everybody have? Uh, I have six. I also have seven. Uh, the, benefit, the benefit of playing <laughs> three two drops, a one drop. <laughs> Yeah. Right. Uh, like normally in a game like this, everyone's out of gas, and you're like, "Guys, do we just scoop?" But there's so much fire. Yeah, there's too much gas. Um, it's a powder keg. It's just funny because I'm just recycling the same gas. Like, right. I, like <laughs> it's the most efficient machine yep. ever created. Yeah, the it's most just... envir environmentally mental or environmentally friendly <laughs> hand that you could possibly have. I, I'm gonna get solemn. So we're playing sad bot again. We're deck thinning. We're working on that deck thinning. Well, what's that do to your Cherix odds? <laughs> Oh, I, can't, yeah. I cannot play. An I now cannot play another island. Oh, boy. <laughs> I wonder if you should run wastes in that deck. 
Oh, like yeah. for exactly this moment, like two wastes. Can somebody blink? Can somebody blink the song? <laughs> no. no. Oh. <laughs> hey, resume. Okay. <sighs> oh, that would be so funny. So that's four there, and that's the land I got. So that's four mana, six mana. I'll play a worm coil. <laughs> Seems good. Yeah, and then uh, well, gee. Uh, <laughs> I think I'll just play Baron, and then I'm going to bounce. Solemn. No, no, surprisingly <laughs> not. <laughs> Make good choices. I think the crab plan is out the door now. Um, <laughs> I, I think I'm going to bounce. I'm really curious what this deck does other than the crab plan. <laughs> uh, it doesn't get this far. Oh, it, doesn't oh, get yeah. <laughs> it, dies. it dies because it makes everybody upset that they've had to replay their hand. <laughs> Um, I cannot imagine why. You know what? Here's here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get saucy. I'm gonna bounce that uh, my own Sakashima back to my hand, Ooh. Uh, and then make play Sakashima uh, as a Sakashima is shroud, right? So you can't target it. Oh, it does. It does. It does. It's not hexproof. It is shroud. Um, okay then. So and you know what? I'll bounce the body double back to hand, and then uh, from there I. I guess I just politely pass and okay. I draw a card. You want know, harm <laughs> harmless offering an island or something, Jake? No, God, no, please. <laughs> I'm going to make a servo and I'll untap and draw. Okay. So I'll tap four and cast Solemn. <laughs> Go get me a land. Yeah. If Good I luck. even have any left. Look at this, though. The legendary rule just doesn't apply to me right now. Just going ham over here. Wow, I think I'm out. <laughs> We've done it. We've bounced the solemn enough times. <laughs> <laughs> what a game. The deck, yeah. out basics. The deck thinned. The, the deck has been thinned. Oh, wow, a lot of good cards in here, though. Wish I could be drawing those. <laughs> Including my sticking hidden commander that I seem like a fool for even mentioning now. <laughs> All right. Here's me in for my friends. I told them you were in this deck. Dude, Mom. <laughs> you're making me look bad in front of the wizards. <laughs> <laughs> I love that scene. That scene is so good. Right, so I got four there. I guess let's just do that. Cast my commander again, and <laughs> yep. then hmm, no I feel land. Like state. <laughs> I've seen so much of this already. I love it. I wonder why, Krim. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. I look. <laughs> I tried Krim. to kill you with the crap, okay? I, I did I did my part. I'm going to cast Krim keeps Rhystic playing study. dumb. But Krim has another instant speed bounce in his hand. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> All right. Uh... Is that a good counter argument? No. <laughs> no, you. Yeah. Oh, reliable. No, you. Your mom's a bounce spell. <laughs> oh! oh, yeah. You, you got me. Got him. <laughs> All right, that's it. I'm gonna pass. <laughs> All right, KT uh, trigger I'm gonna draw a for KT. KT. Put a land in the play. Oh, oh, no, I'm actually just kidding. I'm gonna put a land in play. Drawing a card. Hey, hey, Craig, have, what, what land put, did you put into play? Put Ark of Araska. Oh, okay. Oh. So then oh. I will. So the library trigger. Plus, I just don't have to activate the big crab. You see. That's true. That's true. You see, I don't have to activate. Yeah. But I want you to know. Like, Heck yeah. Chris, is there a way for you to track how many turns this has gone? Um, no, but I can. I can go back. Uh, I think it'd be I, interesting in your uh, interface here if every time it goes around, uh, <laughs> the that data is super track. valuable. Oh yeah, we've yeah. ascended. By the way, everyone, uh, I have the city's <laughs> yeah. blessing. Uh, if you were at all wondering, I, we're warned. But yeah. okay. Uh, so we'll I've got, work. so I I paid the uh I paid the eight life to keep the two cards from the Sylvan. Um Ooh. all the way down so to fifty one, huh? Being real risky with that life. Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna continuing on the track of cards you've seen. I'm gonna play Hamza. <laughs> and then yep. uh, I'm gonna play Abzan Battle Priest. <laughs> I'm gonna play Loyal Unicorn. <laughs> I like that card. Yeah, I like that card. I should have been playing these in different order, but that's fine. Uh, I'm going to play Juniper Order Ranger. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now we're cooking. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. I'm going to play Abzan Falconer. They fly. Yep. They fly now. They fly now. Uh, Clay, help me Help me get Jake, you know? <laughs> help me get Jake. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're friends. I know it might not seem that way. <laughs> Clay, are you paying for Rhystic Study on all of these? No, not one of them. So you got four, five, six. I'm playing Orn Refuse. What does that do? Oh, right. Like every good friend, you know, when a when a party gets weird or anything gets a little too dicey, it's time to bounce. So I've been your friend. I've I've had to help you get out of places. So six and 
three. Alrighty, so now everything with a counter has flying and a lifelink. Sure does. Um, and now we're gonna go to combat. Um, Loyal Unicorn's gonna trigger, so all my creatures have Vigilance, and they don't take any combat damage. Um, <laughs> Kerm's at 40 life. <laughs> <laughs> You're at 55. No, I know. No, I know. I just like <laughs> laughing. Like with everything that happened, it feels like you should be lower. Um, five. So I'm going to swing Krim for 10 in the air and Jake for 10 in the air. Clay don't. Five of which is commander damage. Clay don't. Please don't. Don't, don't swing at me. Don't swing at me, Clay. It's... I'm just splitting it evenly. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, so how much is that me? 10? 10. How much of it is commander? None. The commander is going at Jake. I will willingly just take 10. All right. Uh... Yeah, I'm going to take 10. All right, sweet. So I'm going to gain 20. Yep, yep. Your life total continues to climb. How much commander damage was that, actually? Uh, it was five. Okay. And then I'm going to go to my end step and distribute the uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, the 26 one one counters that I have to I'm distribute. I'm going to draw a card. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I agree, but, um, so I'm going to do, if we do it like, yeah, so three would go on the Loyal Unicorn. That's going to be about six. And then three would go on the Absent Battle Priest. It's going to be six. So it leaves us down to 20 now. I'm going to do four on the Hamza. I, I, it'll be my turn, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's your turn. Yeah, <laughs> okay, sorry. Okay. Just Eventually. Now. Uh, we'll do four on the Sacred Cat. All right, so I don't even know what's a problem on the board anymore. There's just so much on Clay's side. Uh, so with my, yeah. with my total unbiased opinion, uh, since I'm out of the game now, Krim, I think you are the problem. No, Clay's <laughs> well, definitely <okay>. the problem. <laughs> it's... Clay, Clay is definitely the problem. Yeah. Like, yeah. How does one take Clay's board? <laughs> By bouncing. <laughs> you you bounce it a third time. I don't know if Clay can can handle a third time of that. <laughs> At least emotionally. <laughs> uh, okay, well, we're going to have to just play Meteor Golem. Ooh, now what do you target? Uh, I, I would say, like, full disclosure, on my board, the Loyal Unicorn is probably, like, that allows me to just swing each turn and, like, grow my board without, like, risk, right? So, like, that's probably the strongest. Um, but the Falconer and the Priest both give, like, lifelink and flying, so. Uh, yeah. Uh, I guess I'll kill the unicorn. Okay. And then second main, I'll, or I mean, still in first main. And a life thinks Zaxos. Yep. I'll play a Felwar Stone and uh, uh, trigger a Rhystic Study. I'll pay for both. Okay. And that's going to be my turn. Go ahead. Oh, man. Okay. I can't, um, I, we can't do anything, right? Because like Clay's got a huge board and my crab plan is out the door. You've got a huge <laughs> board. Yep. Yeah, another servo untapped. Oh, yeah. Clay, you forgot all the Ronus Monument triggers? Question mark. I I did. So we will say that I put them on the Hamza that could not attack. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> just just so that it's and not trying to like walk it back and say oh, I put somebody out of the game. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, DJ. Oh, w, you die. Yeah. <laughs> I just okay. want us to play by the rules. Yeah. So. Uh, All right. I'm gonna cast a tireless tracker and I'll play a windswept heath for turn. Gives me another rampaging bailouts. Once again, how does your foundry work? I can. It can tap and then make a 1-1, one, one, right? Yeah, or two to tap and make a 1-1. One, one. one to transform the 1-1 one, one into a Thopter, and then into a 4-4. Four, four. I can pay three to untap it. Okay. It's like if Trading Post was made robots. Okay, yeah. very <laughs> cool. All right. That vastly inferior than er, compared to Trading Post. Depends on how you feel about robots versus goats. It's also one mana, so it's um, like just a bonus card all the time, you know? Yeah. I guess I'm going to join Jake in the meantime and gumming up the board. I'm going to tap three, and uh, who? what cards do you guys have in hand? How many cards? I have five. I have, I have two. All right. I'm going to cast Jessica's Will. Uh, so I've got five red mana. Yep. Ooh. Ooh. Cryptolith Rite, adding a green. Uh, and the Rampant Growth, adding a green. And then Heroic Intervention. I don't know if I'm going to use that. We'll see. All right. So casting the Rampant Growth. Oh, actually, no. I, don't, I know I don't have any basics, so that's yeah. dumb. Yeah, <laughs> about to say. All right. So I have six red mana remaining and a ton of mana on board now. All right. So I'll use the six and two to cast Udfara Hellkite. And then uh, I'll tap Solemn. And the two servos for Captain Lannery Storm. Comes in. I get a treasure when she attacks. Yup. Yeah, we, we have moved on up to the east side. Um, now this is a board. <laughs> this is pod racing. <laughs> what a great movie. What a great movie. 
<laughs> I'm gonna tap that and rampaging bay loss. So now I've got five. I'll play doubling season. Uh, I'll sack Lenalendra for that. Sure. Yeah, that that's fine. Toast. <laughs> that is a big no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, let's see what we've got. We've got uh, do do that. That makes sense. Okay. Um, I'm gonna pass turn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> untap Sylvan Library. One, two, three. Uh, sure. So we will, let's see, play a forest. And then, so I'm gonna pay a white to play Speaker of the Heavens. Um, oh, sorry. Uh, my end step, Kaneos and Tiro triggers. Oh, I'll join Dark Harbor Playland. Um, that's gonna get one one counters. Juniper Order Ranger's gonna get counters. Well, you don't have a uh, Lathiel deck list somewhere, do you? I don't, but I should. Um, okay. I'm also going to, in response to that, I'm gonna pay two to draw off Donna Folk. All right, uh, and then uh, we're going to let's see. I'll throw this here. For a green, thanks to Hamza. Hamza is actually what's killing, like making all of this possible. Um, Hamza's a magic card. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna play Slurk. All in just. Oh my gosh! Nice. Um, which yep. is going to get that. Uh, <laughs> so trigger cool. Rhystic Study. I will not pay. Is that the only spell you cast this turn? No, I already. I also cast Speaker of Heavens, but I didn't pay for that either. Um, so land based and. Um, Gain my life. Uh, so not going to get the triggers this time. Rona Small Amendment. We're going to put both of those on Lathiel. So it's a it's got plus four plus four right now. Uh, we're going to play uh, Mindless Automaton for free. It's going to come in. So it's going to get counters. Hey, do you guys remember when Chris was in this game? <laughs> <laughs> when, when, when was that? When uh, was I don't that? even remember. Oh. So long ago. Um, and then actually, so it's four, but then it gets from. Juniper Order Rangers. Well, all right, we're gonna test out the chips. I, I think I realized Chris was actually the person to end the game. Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure I was ever actually in in this game? Yeah, Maybe yes. just, it's been three three Maybe. people the whole time. Yeah, we have played five games today. So right. Uh, and then <laughs> green white. Uh, so I played Mindless Tomaton. I didn't pay for it. Miri Weatherlight Duelist. I'm not gonna pay for it. You can mill out Jake. Please do. <laughs> it's a May ability on Rhystic Study, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Jake, yeah, okay. Thank you for the follow. Um, and then, yeah, let's see. White, white to play together forever uh, so I can support two. Wow. Okay. Trigger Rhystic. I uh, will not pay. I'm going to do like that. Oh, man. Hmm. And then, so we got four mana remaining. All righty. Who wants to go to combat? Combat. You do. <laughs> I do. I do for sure. All right. Um, and so that was one, two, three, four. Yeah, four uh Ronus Monument triggers all on Lathio. So it's got eight uh plus eight plus eight. So ten, <laughs> thirteen. Um so they don't have vigilance now. Do you still have lifelink and flying though? Just so Krim, how many flying blockers do you have? I have Glenelendra. Alrighty, and Jake? Uh I've got one and I could potentially make another. Gotcha. All right, cool. So then, in that case, uh, we're going to do... I guess I could also potentially make another flyer, too. Sure. Alrighty. So, Orin <laughs> Rainclear... Sure, sure. Whatever you say, Krim. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I, I, um, so, Orin <laughs> Juniper Order Ranger, Sacred Cat, and Lathiel are all going at Krim. Conclave Mentor, Daxos, Hamza, the Battle Priest, and the Falconer are all going at Jake. Orin Fuse is going to trigger, so each of them is going to get three one one counters, thanks to... Is, that, is that attackers, though? That's attackers, right? Attacking creatures, yep. Okay. okay. With that on the stack, Krim, do you have any effects? Uh, with, the, with the doubling on? Yeah, yeah like, like I, I pass. I pass priority. Okay. Double it. I'm going to tap one and two for red and green uh, and cast Artifact Mutation on Krim's Lightning Greaves. <laughs> what does Artifact Mutation do? <laughs> Destroy target <laughs> artifact, you make two, one, one. <laughs> I love Fantastic. that. It's, I love that it's Jake's just face, like unmoved, like it's not like the cam, right? So I just look up at yeah. it, like, making that face in response. Yeah. To you get two one ones out of that. Yeah. You get two. Or wait, oh. do I? Yeah, no, I get two one. Yeah, yeah you oh, get two one. man, what a special day it's been. Oh, uh, <laughs> okay. All right, I got two one any ones. Other, any other okay. responses? Yes. Uh, I'm gonna tap three. This isn't how I wanted to do this. Teferi's protection. <laughs> All right, Krim Glenelendra, so that you both go out together. 
I, I could Glenelendra that. You could, but what might happen to you? <laughs> Wait, Krim, how about this? I've got Mazabeth. What if I'm Mazabeth, one of the creatures attacking you? No, no, don't don't worry about this. Now that you cast it at, <laughs> in response, in response, I'm gonna etherize. Oh my god. <laughs> bounce number three. <laughs> He's doing the crab bounce. <laughs> Either way, attacking creatures. Yeah. Yep. All, All right. attacking creatures. All right. Wow. Uh, trigger Ristic. Um, in response to the Ristic, actually, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, I'll, I'll pay it. I'll pay it. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Anything else, Clay? Uh, hold on. I, I, let, I need to look at my hand now and figure out what I can play. <laughs> um, uh, oh, man. Uh, and again, none of my, I've got all of these things that help if creatures would die, but they don't die. They just. Clay, some would say you played the most magic today. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know what? There's certainly an argument to be made for that. <laughs> so... uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Um, so let's play a planes. So we'll play a sacred cat. Um, I'm going to pay, I'm going to, in response to that, I'm going to pay two. I'm going to have my Mirage Mirror copy Ristic Study trigger. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, I'll pay. Okay. You pay for his or mine? His. Oh, thank you. <laughs> and then uh, I'm going to play, and then I'm going to play a Conclave Mentor. Uh, I, I can't pay for either of them. And, uh, I will go to my end step discarding, uh, discarding Avatar the Resolute. All right. I will be right back. And then my turn after? Yes, yep. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, so I think we might have drawn the sauce. All oh right. man. Okay. The we're gonna it wasn't, go. We're it gonna wasn't party. The sauce yet? <laughs> no, no, no. Now it's really the sauce. Now the sauce is here. The sauce is here. Okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell if you're laughing or crying. It's a tiny bit of both. <laughs> it's most it's mostly laughing. This is it's great. Disbelief, really. Yeah. Um three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine, you said. Yeah. I'm gonna cast right a replication. Kick. Ooh. I'll pay the one. Targeting. And then I'm gonna target. I'm phased out. Yeah. And I'm, I'm, gonna target, I'm gonna target uh See here, so I can bounce. A, you're phased out. How many creatures do you have, Clay? I currently have six. All right, so you have six. I'll copy uh, Baron, and so I'll get a total of five copies of that, and I'm going to bounce. Uh, let's see, which one do I want to bounce? I'm going to bounce your your Slurk, all your biggest ones leaving Sacred Cat. Okay. Uh, in response, I'm going to remove three, uh, like six counters from Minus Automaton to draw three. All right, so I have a total of six copies of Baron. And then I'm going to play two, three, four, Bark Double. <laughs> I'm going to copy, uh, I'm going to copy the uh, the Baron. <laughs> and then I'm going to go ahead and bounce. Sacred Cat? Yeah, Sacred Cat. Okay. Then I'm going to attack with Sakashima. Oh, baby. And then with that, I'm going to give uh, Sakashima the ability to uh, hit you for 16 commander damage. Wait, what is Sakashima? It is a 16-1 because it's currently, it's still Cherix from earlier. Yeah. Right. I th I'm sorry. I thought you'd hit that threshold for islands already. All right, cool. No, oh. no, no. I'm at 16 islands right now. Gotcha. Alrighty, I will take 16. I will go 16 Sakashima damage. And then I will pass. <laughs> Alright, I phase back in. Untap everything. Kermon game nice again. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh... <laughs> this would be a nightmare of a game to edit. Yeah, I, I imagine <laughs> yeah. so. My month would go very badly. <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to start off by... Shoot, I think I just go full in on this other thing. I do. All right. I'm going to tap five and cast Fairy Formation. Yup. And then I'm going to play Gaia's Cradle. I have more mana than I thought I did. <laughs> Sorry. I... That's currently on 15. Uh, uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> so. Yeah, that happens. Uh, nope, Cradle. Yeah, I thought about bouncing something off of my own uh, DJ so I could draw seven cards, but I realize I have a lot of card draw. So right now the issue is emptying my hand. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to tap Guy's Cradle for 15, oh, uh, yeah. 15 blue. Yeah, and 15 blue. Seems good. Add, or 15 green. I add a blue to it. Uh, to draw a card, make a 1-1. One, one. All right, so there's my 1-1s. One, uh, add another blue to it, 9 green remaining. Draw a card, no hit, make a 1-1. One, one. Another blue, 
six green remaining draw and then i'll tap these two guys uh to draw the remaining two and make two more one ones that arena code may or may not work if anybody wants to try it <laughs> just snag it real <laughs> yeah, quick just zoom, snag her. zoom and enhance chat you got this you can yeah, totally just... read that okay so now hmm, I was really hoping to draw something that would do the thing. All right, I'm gonna tap two, get my clue, draw for yeah. two. And then you're doing a lot of things this turn. Doing a lot of things. Let's see. <laughs> do I activate again? Um, I, just, I just gotta connect on clay one time with my big crab. Just gotta connect one time. Do that. Tap one of the servos. One of them is remaining. <laughs> draw a card. Shoot and make another thing. A one-one flyer. Criminy. This Criminy. Doesn't do what I like. Criminy. Uh -huh. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Clay, I don't want to take you out this turn. Even if I could, which I, I'm not honestly sure if I could, I could get you within striking distance. <laughs> Somebody's got to go, right? Somebody's got to go. The game must end. Right. Yeah. No. Like, I if you if you have the means, go for it. No, I'm saying uh, uh, at this. I point, don't I want to because I think that we're teammates here. Well, uh, hold on. What? For me <laughs> to win, I think Clay needs to stick around. Hello. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm crab bait. <laughs> yeah. I'm just trying to pinch somebody to death here. Okay, I've again? done it once. You've done it once? Yeah, again. I need to do it again. That's all. all, right, all right. Look, Krim got so got drunk on milling two people. Now Krim wants to pinch two people. <laughs> <laughs> trying to look, Jake. I'll be your deputy again. <laughs> I've got like two claws, two victims, yeah. two claws, exactly. two victims. <laughs> One victim per claw, and that leaves you the winner, the sheriff. All right, I'm gonna swing two at Clay, and I'm gonna get a treasure. I'll take two. All right. Oh, so. but. He's at 53. <laughs> you know that? <laughs> that ain't dead. I'm pretty sure you could have swung out and Clay would have been fine. <laughs> Probably. Uh, okay. So then... just want you to lower your defenses. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is that all I need to do? I do have an army of barons. <laughs> Call it Baron Wasteland, if you will. The, the Baron Brigade. <laughs> All right, well, I'm going to go to my end step. Everyone can draw a card or play land. I'm going to play a land, please. I'm going to draw a card. And I'm going to put a planes. Put down a river glide uh, pathway and then discard a bunch of crap. All right, I'm going to untap. We will draw three. <laughs> Um, Clay, how many times are you going to play your board again? I don't know, Krim. How many times am I going to play my board again? <laughs> this feels like something that depends entirely on uh, you. It is It is unfortunate. Right. Unfortunate's a word. I'm going to play a play. <laughs> um, so let's... How do we do this the most efficiently? <laughs> All right. No one has thought that this whole game. That's true. But like, I, when, I keep, when I keep just trying to avoid discarding the hand <laughs> that was the board. Um, oh, people so, always like, Krim, you counter too many spells, so I don't play any. All no, all no, that was spells. great. Juniper, about too many spells. Juniper Order Ranger. And then... I'm not going to pay for any Rhystics. So I am caught so, so yep. I, I am going to get There's a Rhystic. Two spells thus far. Um, these are each going to get... You said two spells have been casted? Two spells have been cast so far. Okay. Um, so that's two. And then we're going to play a... We'll do, right? Yep. Green-white to do, um, Conclave Mentor. Not paying, I assume? Not paying. Yeah, I'm not going to pay for anything this turn. Okay. Um, in the interest of attempting to... Mana, mana open. Mana open. Um, and then do we do one more before we? This three, four. Nah, doesn't help us now at this point. So green, white again to play. Uh, Hamza, Guardian of Ereshin. Just gonna do three and put Jin four eight. And then from there, we're gonna do minus Thaumaton for free. Just gonna get. Five counters. Juniper Order Ranger is going to go to eleven. Um, Ooh, is that a reef worm in your uh, graveyard there, Jake? It's a reef worm. We're the class hitting the reefer, huh? All right, all right. We're gonna we're gonna see that Wait for Lathiel. Uh, I'm assuming you're not paying, so I'm nope. gonna draw go for it. And then um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we're not gonna be able to get everything out, but if we do. White for Falconer. It's the pile of unplayables just set aside over here. <laughs> Hello, Johnny. How are you, buddy? We're going to do green for long shot squad. So now they have both reach and flying. And then white for Abzan Battle Priest. 
And then that does what again? I forgot. That's my flink. Okay. These cons lords are really coming in handy. This is my my con triforce contrived force. Um, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we do have to still discard. Uh, uh, before you go to second main, I mean, before you leave second main, I have I have an effect. Okay, uh, I am I am attempting to leave second main. Uh, I'm gonna play Venser. <laughs> okay. And I'm going to bounce. Jake, how many dra- how many flyers do you have? Uh, five, six. I have six flyers. I can make more. Um, I'm gonna just bounce your dragon. All right. Uh, with that on the stack, are you tapped out? Yeah. All right. I will tap this many, that, and that, uh, and that. Is this Psychrift? It is. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. I love it. We do it again. Oh my god. This comes back to my hand. <laughs> bounce bounce four. I guess Baron did bounce Clay's entire board, so we're gonna count that as five. <laughs> <laughs> Clay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I and so I died of this is where I do the spin, right? And then whoa, yep. knocked out. I uh, see uh, I was I didn't even bounce you that many times. This is assuming that this is assuming that Jake can do 48 damage to you, Clay. I can. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, I figured. Well it's it's, it's we're doing this at the end. Like now it's gonna be my turn, right? Yes, now you got a turn, play. which is so now this is even better I'm still at my I'm still in second main, so now I go to end step and have to actually discard my hand. Oh <laughs> Yep, that is a that's a slightly uncomfortable feeling. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, oh my god, thank you, Johnny, for the gift sub. <laughs> perfect timing, perfect timing there too, bud. So beautiful. I'm gonna discard armor, craft, judge, bow of Nylia. I'll take speaker. my turn, right? While you, yeah, yeah, go for it, yeah. Okay. Four. Now that the crab plan is out the window, I'm gonna play my islands. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so it's all coming together. All, all according Slur. to plan. <laughs> huh. So you have like an a silly army here, right? You have like a oh silly army. army. Yeah, Clay, don't forget your enchantments go and artifacts go up to your oh, hand. Yes, sure. Thank oh, you, right. DJ. That goes back. Absolutely. Um, uh, I'm gonna play we so caught up on that. Oh, you just didn't even Starting get to the uh, solemn. No, you yeah, no. Nice try. <laughs> we're we're gonna kill the the fairy. Trigger Ristic study. Uh, I will not pay. All right. Uh, I'm gonna tap four beasts and the fairy. Uh, to draw a card and make a flyer. Okay. All right. And then the fairy dies. All right. Then I'm gonna go ahead and play. She will your scoop. Oh, this actually goes back to my hand. Um. So yeah. So I'm discarding one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, uh, eight, nine, eleven. 12, yeah, Krim, 13, 14, Your your mana 16. rocks all went back to your hand. Oh right, 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 right. Well, this this is fine for soul ring. I'll still pay yeah. one, pay yeah, soul yeah. ring, do that. Three, four. It five, maps out to be the six, same. Seven. Uh, yeah. All right. All there. So this is what I've got. Three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen mana to work with. Um. All right. I'll play glass pole mimic, copying meteor golem. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, you're gonna draw. By the way, Jake. I'm gonna blow up your little uh token factory. Token factory is dead. Then. And what else do you have on board? How many creatures again? Like you have a lot, right? Like how many baylots? I have four beasts, uh, uh-huh. six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay. Uh, I'm just oh, going. Uh, sorry, plus six here. Okay. Uh, that's fine. I'm just going to go to end step and discard. All right. Uh, I'm going to. Smells untap. like another bounce. No. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> All right, well, if I go out, then it's going to be very cool, and you're all going to say, hey, that was a hoot. Um, I'm going to say that anyways. I'm at that point, no matter how this game ends. All right, I'm going to tap one, play a soul ring. And then I'm going to play a command tower for turn, trigger there. So I've got 20 creatures now. I will tap my Gaius Cradle for 20 green. Reasonable. I'm going to use four of it. Uh, and actually, I don't think I do that yet. All right, I'll add a red to it, cast... Perforos. I've got 17 green left. Uh, casting Perforos. Um, how much? You have 17 green left, you said? Yeah. Okay. That happens? Yeah. All right. Um, and then... Six. Oh, wait, hold on. How much mana do you have open? Sorry. You have. You still have Cryptolith rights, right? Yeah. Oh, that's a problem. I got, like, a lot. Oh, that's a really big problem. I forgot you had Cryptolith right. Probably should have blown that up. Um, hmm. Okay. Yeah. I got nothing to do about that. Uh, I discard all that, and I'm putting my commander in the command zone. All right. 
I'm going to tap blue, then another blue. I'm going down to 15 green, casting Vizier of Many Faces. Yup. That will copy Purpuros, God of the Forge. Or sorry, a uh, creature. So. Do you have Devotion? I don't. Uh, so I'll have it copy Kaneo Centiro, and it's going to die. Okay. We've got 15 green left. I'm going to use... Perf trigger, right? We each take two. Trigger, right? That's right. Yep. Yeah, you each take two. I'm going down to 12 green. I'm going to embalm Vizier of Many Faces. This is the trick. I'm going to target Rampaging Baylots. Uh, and, yeah. Okay. And Let me see here. Uh, hold on one second. That one is a bit of a problem. I mean, yeah, I, I, I guess, yeah, yeah, yeah. God, this fucking Psych Rift is going to wreck me so bad. Uh, <laughs> all right, so I've got 12 green left. I'm going to add a blue and a white to it. So I'm going down to 10 green. I'm going to cast Avon Wind Guide. Yeah. Uh, what does that do? What does My that do? favorite. Creature tokens you control at Flying and Vigilance, and it's got Embalm for six. Two from Perf. Perf hmm. trigger. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, take two. All right, I'm gonna go down to that. Let me find the six. Okay, six green, add two red to it. So now I have six green left. Dragon layer spider. Uh, Perforous trigger. Uh, yep. I need to read the spider. Yeah. Uh, two. Sorry, it's not pulling up. I think something there we make go. it in. Whenever your opponent casts a spell, make me sad. He, uh, how much mana do you have left? I have six green left plus many, at least over twenty, maybe over thirty. Um. Jeez, uh, how do I get out of this? I think I think there's a line here that gets me out of this. I'm just seeing if I can do it. Okay, this is a commander clash. We can't see your hand, so no one will, yeah. yell, will yell at you in the YouTube comments. I I think I can do it, though. I can get out of that. I think my strategy is to try to cast my hand so that the purpose triggers from Dragon Lair Spider kill Krim before I die. Jeez, <laughs> uh, Louise. Uh, yeah, I, I guess, yeah. And then I'm going to use the four green, a red, and a blue, and cast my commander, Brutaclad Telcor Engineer. Ooh. So your tokens have haste? My tokens have haste, and I make a 2-1 at the beginning of combat. Then all of my tokens become a copy uh, of one of my tokens. I choose what it is. Can the ones that just cards that came into play this turn, can you tap them with Uh, w With my creature tokens, yeah. Yeah, right, because that's going to make it that you can, so that's a problem. Uh... Okay, so on the stack, I think I have to do this now. Uh, I'm going to pay four, five, six. I'm going to play Sakashima's Protege. Okay. Uh, Cascade. Uh, I get Sakashima's Student. I'll cast that. I'm going to copy Meteor Golem. Okay. Meteor Golem will go ahead and blow up your... Uh, can't blow up your Perforos. Uh, I think I got to blow up... What do I, what's the target? Though? I guess the Spider? I don't know. I mean, the Cryptolith rights. Yeah, I think it's going to be the Cryptolithrites. Okay, that goes down. And go uh, th there are still two cast triggers, right, for the spider. So Jake gets two tokens. Oh, yeah, right. So we're two... in a cast. Oh, yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah, so, so we'll take four from Perforos. And then you have the Sakshima. Yeah, so Protege will now resolve. Okay. Um, I will copy uh, something that entered the battlefield this turn. Uh, I'm going to copy the Sakashima student. Okay. And I'm going to blow up your spider. All right, spider goes. All right, so then uh, I'm going to go to combat. Brutaclad makes a 2-1. and take then two. Yep, everyone takes two. And then I've got 1, 6, 8, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I've got 20 copies of Rampaging Baylots. Okay. All right, because the, the Vizier is a token. That's right. Yeah. Oh, so That's 26. so good. All right. And so I good. have a bunch of meteor golems. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, that's that's me doing the thing. I'm gonna go to combat and attack ten at each of you. So ten six sixes. I will take sixty. I will ether spouts. What does it do? Uh, put each attacking creature in its owner. Uh, put each attacking creature. It's or, or no, sorry. For each attacking creature, its owner puts it on the top or bottom of his or her library. Okay. With that, I'm going to cast. Uh, I'm going to tap four. Oh, they all have vigilance. Uh, and cast entrapment maneuver. Target player sacrifices an attacking creature. I make X one one. So I'm going to sacrifice one of the ones that's attacking clay. And then I'm going to make six 1-1 one, one dudes. So we each take 12. Each take 12. And then, um, blah, 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 blah. crap, Krim, you're like, you're, uh, you're really close to it. Gosh, I think that... Uh... Hey, thank you for the follow, George Adolio. Thank you. Okay, uh, I'm going to tap these for 19 mana. Okay. Uh, wait, wait, how do you tap it for mana? They have oh, the flying vigilance. Oh, it's, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay, uh, so I needed to tap. 
that then. All right, so that happens. Uh, okay. They vanished. I've got six one one dudes. Um, did you pay for a Rhystic Study? No. All right, draw for for that. And okay, how many cards in hand? I have six, seven. Go oh, to yeah. play is not dead. Go to my end step. Everyone can draw a card or play land. I'm gonna draw a card. I'll draw a card. I'm gonna play. Cool. Cafe. Uh, trigger here. I get a clue. Oh man. Now we're cooking. That was nice and close. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I got to do the thing. Let's have draw. Ooh. Oh man. All right. How do we do this? <laughs> Okay, so I had uh, Beast enter, so you guys take Perforos damage. Yeah, take two. All right, so I think, I think I just play my hand and kill Krim and get second. <laughs> How do you kill me already? With you have eight? No, with Perforos triggers. I just play no, all no. my creatures. Oh, Perforos is... Done. That's yeah. right, that's right, that's right. Never mind. Just kidding. I totally wasn't planning on doing that, Krim. Huh. <laughs> okay. Ah. Jake, remember, uh, I, didn't, I haven't changed my mind. Or maybe I have on second place. <laughs> okay. Three green white for Juniper Order Ranger. Um, green white for Conclave Mentor. Oh, no, actually, just kidding, because we don't have hardened scales anymore. Uh, and then, um, let's see. What's the best way to do this mathematically? Um that i knock bond can the first strikey one right yeah first strike yeah and then so now it's one green white one green white for hamza yup six um and then <laughs> abzan falconer so they all have flying they all have flying and first strike and then abzan battle priest no, they all have <laughs> yeah. yeah. I've this deck has been able to play yeah, way yeah, more yeah. than I've ever expected it to. I <laughs> has never played this many spells in this lifetime, let alone in uh, in a game. Uh and then we're gonna play Mindless Automaton for free. My deck is not very good at killing anything. It can't connect to save its life, but boy does it <laughs> do Don't save its thing. life. <laughs> all right, cool. Uh that's my turn. Oh, right. yeah, Jake, had, you had seven Rhystic Study draws. Yeah, I've been keeping up. Okay, cool. I'll play Reliquary Tower. Uh, okay, somebody has to go this turn. Jake's got the entire army back, uh, hanging out, waiting for something. <laughs> you know what? I, I think uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Sakashima will copy Meteor Golem. Meteor Golem will then blow up your Brutoclad. Dies. How many blockers do you have now? Uh, you have six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fourteen. Oh, sorry, thirteen. Then I'm gonna play Body Double as a way to copy my. Um, or let me see. You have a Brutoclad reads tokens have haste, right? Creature tokens you control have haste. Yeah. So then I think I'll go ahead and copy that. But make it become brutal clad. Brutal clad then gives me one, two, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna copy worm coil engine and then uh geez Louise. I actually know I have to copy that because I need to gain life. Yeah, no, I copy brutal clad. I copy brutal clad. So sure. uh with that now I can oh, wait, I threw my mana away. I don't know why I threw my lands away. Uh pay it. I will cast stolen identity uh and then i'm gonna go ahead and copy uh the worm coil engine okay and uh i'm gonna go ahead and put any of your stuff all your stuff flies right jake all of my creature tokens do all your creature tokens do and you have no tokens hanging back except for the one beast well, there's six soldiers i got six one ones and oh you have oh right the one one. Oh, geez oh maybe i'm just dead uh yeah. okay i'll just go ahead and turn i'll put the stolen identity on the uh, the the Sakashima that is a copy of I forgot what Meteor Golem or yeah yeah and then so I'll have the Worm Coil Engine uh, Worm Coil Engine's there how do I get out of this spot I don't think I can I'm gonna attack with the token the the Worm Coil token all right I've got a sick ass fucking move okay uh, I'm gonna block with six one ones uh, once you've ordered blockers, let me know. Wait, wait, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Who, who, uh, I guess, yeah, it's fine. It seems like implied that I am attacking you, so yeah. Um, yeah, okay, yeah, just uh, whatever order you choose. Okay, I'm going to cast Mirror Weave. Each other creature on the battlefield is now a Worm Coil Engine. Okay. <laughs> Forever? Uh, until until end of turn. turn. Oh, So okay. all of my Worm Coil Engines here, six of them die. I'm going to have 12 ETB triggers on Perforos. Oh, that's pretty sweet, but uh, let, hold on. So I guess the Mirror wait. Weave would be on the stack. Right? Mirror so, weave is on the stack. You may interact. Yeah. So if there's, hold on, if there's six worm, oh yeah, because it's death touch, so it's gonna apply lethal and then lethal. That's why you right. had, that's why you had order blockers. Yeah, that makes sense. You have to do one to each of them, which is death um, touch damage. Alvencer. 
bouncing on the your... mirror weave. I think I'm gonna put that on the. Oh, let's see. the so mirror weave reads all your creatures, right? All creatures. Period. Yeah, all, I'm gonna. All I'm gonna. All of yours too. Oh well, I mean that's irrelevant. Okay, uh, sure. I'm gonna yeah, put you... that on the. I'm gonna put that on the perforos. I'm gonna bounce your perforos back to your hand. Sure. Okay, that goes back to my hand. All right, so I have six tokens that pop. Yeah. And then I gain 36. And I gain six. I lose the token. I get, or I lose the, the worm coil token. I get, get two, three coils. Uh, and it's your turn. All right, so I've got six of one, half a dozen of the other. So, and then Sakashima has stolen identity. I don't know if that's ever been more apt, like in the history of I know, of isn't that nice? <laughs> that's so good. <laughs> I'm so glad you said that. Ooh. That makes me happy. All right, um, so I'm going to tap that many and cast Perforos and however many else I need to cast uh, Avenger of Zendikar. Oh, <laughs> nice. Any effects? I'm dead. None. Good game, guys. Good oh, game. my gosh. Ooh. That was brutal. Good game. Wow. That was impressive. I love this. That yeah, was that a really was cool awesome. game. That, that was awesome. That was absurd. Just, just absurd. <laughs> I, yeah, that was yeah, like that, that was great. Oh my god, I love that. I yeah, mean, that's secret commander. That's my favorite card. Yeah, Brutal I was happy to even get to that Brutal point. Class. Yeah, yeah. The game took long enough that like I had, I was able to set up with a huge. Yeah, that's cool. Like, yeah, like that's... that is so rough. Woo. What a long, strange trip it's been. Yeah, that was really fun though. Holy <laughs> cow, so much magic. Yeah, it reminds me yeah. of the uh, Chidi Face story on the subreddit. You guys yeah. remember that? No. Well, somebody was like, all right, you can cheat in the game, uh, but you may only cheat one kind of way. And then some guy revealed at the end of the game, every single creature is a copy of Chidi Face. Right. And he had like cheated on the battlefield. It's a fun story. You should look it up on the... Yeah, because he, he, he like hit them behind the sleeves or whatever and like attacked out for something and just un... They're like, no, that out. doesn't kill me. Yeah, just a little Yu-Gi-Oh trap card. Uh, yeah, oh. I remember reading that. That's a classic. I should, I should, I should find that real quick. But uh, yeah, no, that's a, that's a good one. Good job. That game, that, that game went, really uh, went a lot longer than I expected. But it, it went. Yeah, about... It had to be like twenty five turns. Yeah, yeah, I think once I think again, right. the game ends a lot sooner if Chris survived. <laughs> but at the same time, Chris got knocked out pretty early. Yeah, yeah. yeah no, I was very. I, I had a great start, which is fair. Like yeah, I, I would have gotten rid of me too. I, like, I think had... it's funny because, like, to me, other than like you know maybe a trample effect, like. Chris wasn't really a threat to me. <laughs> yeah, same. As you know, so <laughs> well, once he goes unblockable, right? I mean, well, for Jake, it's fine because Jake has maze. What if he goes unblockable it, and then hit? I gave it shroud. I, had I couldn't go unblockable. That entrapment maneuver oh, yeah. and uh, the Tavares protection, I had those very early. Oh, you were ready. <laughs> that, was, that was good. That was good. That was like, holy it was a fun time. Time. And, That was a good oh, yeah, Sunday. And, and Jake, had, Jake had that maze of it. So, like, I could never get, <laughs> get at Jake the entire, like, the rest of the game because I had to, unfortunately, go quarter my own uh Rose back. <laughs> Rose back. <laughs> yeah. oh, wow that oh, was man. good that was good uh, I, I, I i got i got to pinch you i gotta pinch you yeah. chris that that's what mattered <laughs> I got, I got, got, I got crabs. Yeah, like my, like my ex girlfriend, Prim. Damn. Um. Uh. So okay. So um. Whew, that was amazing. Uh. That was so much fun. Thank you both. Thank you both for being here. And of course, Clay, as always. Thank you. Me. Thank you for playing. Um. Yeah. That was blast. Yeah. Let's uh. Let's go around and um. Real quick, tell everybody where where they can find you. I know we did this at the top of the show, but we're we're gonna go ahead and do it on our way out. So Prim, uh, where where can everybody find you? Uh, you can find me once again playing the style of decks on a lot of the MTG Goldfish content. So, like, I do Commander Clash with Tomer, Saffron Olive, all of them. And then I do, uh, you know, streams on my Twitch channel, uh, twitch.tv slash the Asian Avenger. That's also my social media for everything. Uh, all things dirtily, slow control, blue and black. I'll probably, it'll probably be there. I also play a ton of MMOs like WoW and Final Fantasy 14. So uh, go do that. Go do the follow thing. And of course, go follow everyone else here. Awesome. Thank you, Krim. Yeah, um, congrats on, on becoming a Shadowbringer finally. Uh... Yes, finally got the Shadowbringers. <laughs> that felt amazing after all that uh, dialogue. Yeah, that was, uh, that was, that was an intense stream because you went straight for like eight hours or something, right? Just doing I plot thought quests. I, I thought it was almost done. My mistake for assuming that the Final Fantasy st storyline would be a lot simpler. <laughs> yep. Uh, Jake, where can everybody find you? 
Uh, so I am a full-time editor at the Command Zone, so you see me on all kinds of content here and there. Uh, there's a couple of podcast episodes with me on them. Uh, you can find me on our Extra Turns episodes. Uh, I mainly work on game nights, and I actually was, uh, I got my first time credited as supervising editor on this latest episode of Game Nights, which has a uh, uh, Hawk from Cobra Kai in it. It's a really fun episode. That is a wild episode. It that, is, that, was, uh... that was a sweet episode. <laughs> the the behind sure. the scenes of it was just there was a lot that went on like all the 3d and stuff that we started integrating like we're always moving up and uh yeah so it was cool to see my name up in lights like that in the (laughs) description box but yeah i also answer a ton of questions in uh my content creator tech help discord uh, which you can find on my twitter page jake boss mtg along with a bunch of uh emotional sappy videos about magic the gathering on my youtube channel jake boss mtg awesome all right and uh clay where can everybody find you uh yeah you can find me on twitter and twitch at the mtg underscore clayby uh otherwise you can find me here on wednesdays and uh, wednesday evenings and sundays uh playing edh just like we're doing here uh otherwise you can find me on twitter where i just tweet like i'm stuck in a time loop just like tonight with the game. <laughs> <laughs> let's play your board again one let's more time play, let's uh, you know it's basically just a, a tweet complaining about work a tweet uh, excited about a combo that I found on Arena, uh, and then a tweet that's a picture of my pets. And we kind of just go in circles, so. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm Chris. I'm uh, the other host of the CNC Power Hour here. And um, let's see, uh, we stream Sundays at 4 p.m. Eastern and Wednesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern. This upcoming Wednesday, it's going to be uh, Quad Nines, uh, who has uh, shown up uh, on a bunch of other people's streams. She's pretty famous for uh, always having an Omnath deck ready to go. Uh, I think she has one one of each Omnath uh, ready to play. And then there's also Andy Zupke from the uh, Scrap Trawlers that will be joining us uh, this Wednesday. And if you missed it, we did a Commander uh, roundtable talking about call time, uh, the cards and the impact on the format and all sorts of sorts of fun stuff. We did that. The VOD is still available here. It will be up on YouTube soon. But uh, that was a solid, like, it was probably one of the best two-hour conversations we've ever, we've ever like, put out there. And it was it was great. It had Chase, uh, aka Mana Curves, uh, Charlotte from uh, the CAG and uh, hosted by uh, Chris, uh, your commander mechanic who was in chat earlier. Our friend Ken from Stacked EDH and Angelo from uh, EDH Rec and of course Clay uh, did that. And uh, yeah, it was it was great. If you have some time, definitely definitely go check it out. It was uh, a lot of fun to put together and uh, they had a, a had a great conversation. But right now what we're going to do is uh, we're going to raid Voxy real quick. Uh, so stay in chat. Uh, we're going to go to our splash screen and I want to say thank you again uh, to, to everybody here for playing and everyone in chat for hanging out um so we're gonna go to our splash screen and then once we do that we're gonna gonna go raid boxy so uh say hi uh tell her something nice uh and have a great rest of your night so bye everybody bye everyone have a good night